Yeah, hey guys, we here today, you feel me? Decided I was gonna stop by, you know, go see a movie. So, but nah, today though, today, we about to see why Sound of Freedom is catching all this flack. So I'm about to go watch Sound of Freedom now. And if for those of y'all who know me, y'all already know that I know what's up, so, so you feel me? So I'm not walking into this blindly, so I'm gonna watch it though, you feel me? And we gonna see what, you know, what we can interpret from the film. Bro, this is wild. Can you believe that? We in the middle of the film, Sound of Freedom. And guess what? The theories are correct. The freaking movie just shut off like in the freaking middle of it. I don't even know how many minutes we had left of it, but it down, it down cut off. Damn, like what's up with that, bro? What's really going on? <laughs> Just finished watching the film, Sound of Freedom. And uh, that was a very, very, very heartfelt movie. It was, damn, that was a heavy movie. That was a heavy movie. It's a PG-13 movie, but that was a heavy movie. Now, I'm just gonna tell y'all this. I'm gonna tell y'all, whoever says that the movie Sound of Freedom is a political view or a political issue, there's a goddamn lie. They a damn lie. You wanna know why? Cause this movie is not political. There's not no political issue. This type of film is a moral issue. It's a moral issue. And it's moral topics. It's not about politics. It's about moral issues. What we should tackle. And it's just not, of course it's not a topic to, you know, talk about. It's not, cause nobody wants to talk about that. It's just, the people who portrayed the people in the film who portrayed like the actual people and portray inside the whole film they were so convincing like they wanted it to make it as raw as possible like the truth can be raw the truth can be ugly and this is like a perfect interpretation of just you know, on a very touchy subject, on a very disgusting subject, subject on top of that, is I was just, there were certain people in the film, like, they did their part so well, I was just very dis disgusted, like, it's like, they keep the movie PG-13, which I'm glad they do, they don't show nothing graphic or anything like that, so you don't have to worry about that, but, like, the whole film, it just had me just on edge, like, it was just, it's quite an it's quite an experience though. This is like a once in a lifetime type of experience for a movie going to a movie theater. Cause usually when I go to a movie theater, I have like the exhilarating feeling when I'm watching a movie, just exhilarating, you know, watch a Marvel film or something like that. But this one right here, I just knew that this one, how it was just gonna be just a heavy film. Like I kid you not, like I freaking was teary eyed. I freaking started tearing up. Like, I'm literally freaking, like, tearing up freaking watching the movie, bro. Like, dead ass, like, for real. It was, like, really serious. Like, because it's not just a film. Like, this is actual issues that's still happening, still going on. And we can't condone this. We can't tolerate that. That's why we just got to speak up more. It's not targeting no political group. It's not no which political group's right, which political group's wrong. This is a moral issue that needs to be addressed. And you gotta freaking do something and spread more awareness about that. That's all I'm gonna say on that matter. So, Sound of Freedom, I don't even know how to rate the movie. Like, I wouldn't rate the movie bad, of course, but the movie was like, they did they did a well, well job. Like, especially from, uh, I guess, like a Christian studio, if you wanna call it that. Yeah, so Angel Studio. So, coming from a Christian studio, y'all may think, oh yeah, it might be like, you know, cheesy Christian uh, studios or cheesy or something like that. But nah, they actually like hit the nail right on the head and it was just a deep movie. So, anyways guys, I appreciate y'all for tapping in and listening to me rant and just vent. 
all the emotions that I was dealing with while watching this film. So yeah, hope y'all have a good one.